Hey, it's Coach Tom Ferry. Welcome to Life by Design, your place online for ideas, inspiration, and how to stay in the right action. Number 29, stop P and M. Check it out. One of my dear friends, Mike Vance, wrote this wonderful little book. The book is actually called Stop Pissing and Moaning. Stop Pissing and Moaning. I want to just read you a little word of explanation. This is a self-help book written in a good-natured, humorous way. The ideas, suggestions, references, and contents contained within are presented with light-hearted manner. They are, of course, there are, of course, thousands of issues that justify pissing and moaning, i.e., violating important values, not honoring sacred beliefs, and undermining accepted principles. However, instead of pissing and moaning, people should speak up and do something about it. They should offer a solution. This, pro this book provides a structure to help you evaluate yourself and others to learn how to stop pissing and moaning. Let's begin. Now, I read that to you because I'm sure you're saying, why is he saying pissing on a video? I love this guy. I love his partner, Diane Deacon. They are dear friends of mine, one of my mentors. And really what he's saying, you know, you can go to, you can, by the way, get these. They're awesome. StopPissingAndMoaning.com. All CEOs should have one of these on, every leader should have one of these on their desk. Really what it comes down to is resource versus resourcefulness. Um, in my line of work, I'm constantly talking to people about the problem they're facing and the challenge they're trying to overcome and, you know, what they're trying to do. And, and inevitably what I keep hearing over and over again is, you know, Tom, I ran out of time or I didn't have the money or I didn't have the contacts I needed or I didn't have the closing skills or I needed the, a better software or an app or I needed another team member or buyer's agent and what we're doing is we're blaming resources for what's not going on in our business. We're blaming resources instead of really what this whole book is about is acknowledge everybody pisses and moans. Everybody you know is constantly trying to figure out how to do better but some people complain about it. And they don't, they don't just do something about it. It really drives the message home for me that there's people that blame resources and then there's people that use resourcefulness. They are just resourceful. And really what the essence of every one of these videos is about is finding in your heart and in your mind and in your soul and in your gut the ability to be resourceful, to ask for help, to do research, to do whatever it takes to roll up your sleeves, to ask for questions or ask questions, to be resourceful and never blame resources as the cause of why your life or your business isn't absolutely operating at the highest possible level. Inside every one of us, we have a gift and it's our responsibility to capitalize on that gift. It is our responsibility to capitalize and be your very best every single day. So as you progress into 2013, Never blame resources. Don't be a pisser and a moaner. And let's be resourceful and make sure that 2013 absolutely is the best year ever for you. Thanks for watching. Remember, always your strategy matters. And now more than ever, your passion rules. 2013, check out the site, stoppissingandmoaning.com. You'll be happy you did. Take care.